Hello everybody and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today's video is going to be another video on my Fedole Rea. I know they have just had an update video, but since then they have absolutely exploded in numbers. The amount of brew that this colony has now is just insane. I mean, it wasn't even like maybe two weeks ago that this colony was actually kind of struggling with brood, and now all of a sudden, just a massive, like huge explosion of brood. I mean, just look at all of that pupae. And this isn't even all of it. This is just one of the most amazing things I've ever seen, honestly. Just the speed that this Fatale species grows at. I mean, most Fatale species, they grow really fast, but to see a Fatale species this big just grow this fast is just insane. Seeing these majors is just... wow. I mean, every single time I look into here and just see the majors walking around, like, I'm just amazed at their size. And just to think that, like, there is a bigger major out there than these guys, and I have quite a few max size, normal sized majors. And of course, there is the queen in all of her glory, hiding from the camera, of course, around all of her eggs. The queen has actually been rather skittish lately, but it seems like right now she's very calm. Of course, you can see some more major larvae as, you know, just went into passing, and you can see that I've started to give them a more of a variety of seeds. I have started to give them chia seeds, which of course I've been giving them that since they were little, uh, some Kentucky bluegrass seeds with they, which they just started to actually like, and some other various seeds that I don't even know the name of. All I know is that my messer used to absolutely love those seeds. Of course, here is one of the many trails inside of the nest where they just have a constant highway of ants just moving from area to area. I'm starting to think that I will have to give them another nest coming really soon, like extremely soon. Most of their nest right now is just all seeds, pupae, and larvae. It's just absolutely amazing. Here's the time lapse of me actually giving them their food here, or their um, seeds that you saw inside of the nest. This is just the massive pile that I dumped in there. This is the most seeds I've ever given them at one time. I just wanted to see how they would react to it, and also just to see that trailing motion of them just going in and collecting all those seeds. You can see a very distinct trail as well. Like, these ants are massive trailing ants in the wild. They're known to trail for a while, like many yards, just constantly going uh, in, in any direction, just to seeds, food, anything that they really want to trail to. <laughs> They really do kind of remind me of Limatopum apiculatum with just the level of trailing that they love to do, except for the fact that it's not as strong of a want as it is in Limatopum apiculatum, which was just insane and I couldn't even keep up with it. Anyways, on to the actual full view of the nest. This is what I see pretty much constantly, because I normally don't really go up and record all these ants constantly, but you can see that this is pretty much what I see. Every single time I uncover them, this is just insane. Just constantly seeing all this brood is just beautiful. Also, don't mind the ants that are like in the bottom of the frame. Those are for gonna be for a different video. A uh, little bit of a secret sneak peek, I guess. Now it comes down to the feeding. Uh, feeding this colony is probably one of the most rewarding things I think I've ever done. Just seeing them swarm all this food, it really reminds me of Solenopsis species with just how intense the swarming is. I mean, they just absolutely swarm all the food items. Like, you can just see right now, just all the workers that are out just trying to hold this thing down even though it is dead, uh, it is still moving, trying to keep it on the ground as they go and eat it is just absolutely insane. It really does just show the ferocious appetite that these ants have, it's amazing. Anyways, that is it for the update portion. I guess you guys can enjoy the rest of this time lapse as it is, and I will shut up and let you guys do that.
Thank you all for watching this video. You guys can check out my Instagram where I oftentimes post stories and all sorts of stuff like that. You can also check out the two Discord servers, and Keeping Anthology and Ants Anonymous, where you can easily get in contact with me. Also, check out my Patreon. My Patreon is the best way that you can go ahead and support these type of videos, and it would mean a lot to me if you were to go over to become a patron, but you don't have to. Anyways, thank you for watching this video, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye.